comedian Janine Garofalo. From the TV show The King of Queens, Jerry Stiller and comedian Bill Broden. Nobody wants to see me nude, okay? Do not patronize me. We have a uh, big, big show for you this evening, ladies and gentlemen. A lot of fun stuff planned. Very cool guests are here. I'm excited. And I thought we should uh, start the show by talking once again about the biggest thing on television right now, Survivor. Are you watching this show? Who's watched it? You've seen the show? Okay. This thing is, uh, this thing is huge. I get, apparently what? Like, how many people watched it last night? 600 million people watched it last night. That doubled our viewership, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> uh, we have more people in our studio audience than watching at home, apparently. No. <laughs> Just kidding. Show's doing great. <laughs> uh, yeah! Wow. You'll buy anything I say. Uh, no, but last night on Survivor, I'll give you an update in case anybody didn't see it, which is hard to believe. But here's what happened last night on the episode. Some people say it was the best episode yet because the cast members ate rats, right? Then they voted a 27-year-old lawyer off the island. That's what they did last night on the show. Yeah. That was the plot. Yeah, which is, a, uh, which is a real shame because the lawyer was the only one who really bonded with the rats. <laughs> I thought it was odd. Uh, because they're scum. Uh, <laughs> what I said was wrong. <laughs> uh, this is, I got some interesting sports news. Uh, last night in his uh, first appearance since returning to the Atlanta Braves, John Rocker threw just six pitches before his manager took him out of the game. Yanked him. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, when asked about it, Rocker said, you know, I'm glad uh, my manager took me out because I was throwing like a queer. <laughs> Yeah. Was. So apparently, apparently he's learned his lesson. Uh, this is a big story uh, here today in, in New York. Yesterday, uh, the federal government, you probably heard about this, cracked down on an alleged mafia ring operating on Wall Street. The mafia is on Wall Street now. Yeah, and folks, so you could kind of tell that mobsters had infiltrated Wall Street because the other day, instead of ringing a bell to open trading, they had a guy yell, butta bing! <laughs> Which is just a giveaway. Half the band's Italian and they don't like that. <laughs> Max laughing real hard at that oh, one. That so Jimmy funny. and Jerry Lavino are not the so happy. <laughs> Max, you're starting my car tonight. All right, let's, uh... I'm not... What? We're friends! We're friends! 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 I don't want any trouble. Then, uh, last thing I'll mention, folks. Gotta mention this. Big story. Roseanne... Roseanne has announced that she's planning to do a nude pictorial for Playboy. Yeah, and uh, yeah, when, uh, when, when asked about it, Roseanne admitted it wasn't her idea to pose nude for Playboy. The idea came from the publisher of Penthouse. Because that was... <laughs> 
The vino's happy, yeah. <laughs> they work together. All right, let's uh, talk about tonight's show. Great show this evening. Uh, we got very cool people on the program from the, uh, she has three upcoming summer movies, which I think is too much, and she should be stopped. She has, <laughs> coming up, The Adventures of Rocky and Bullwinkle, a movie called Titan AE, and a movie called Steal This Movie, Janine Garofalo. <laughs> Janine Garofalo. She's got all these things going on. We also have, uh, you remember, of course, this guy from, we've done so many things, but most recently he was on Seinfeld. Now he's on the uh, hit TV show, The King of Queens, Jerry Stiller. <laughs> Distinguished. A mustache. And then a... Uh, a, uh, a very funny uh, comedian on the program. Thrilled to have him here. Bill Broadus is going to be here. He's a good man. And right over here wearing a... That's a very nice... What is that? A powder blue? A pale blue? A dark blue? I guess no one watches... Uh, in, the show is not in color anymore. Max Weinberg and the Max Weinberg. Seven. Max, good to see you. <laughs>